Welcome to the Pro-Am sidecar mount video. The sidecar mount is similar to a hostess tray, but made of 80 by 20. Extruded aluminum allows you to mount the system, adjust the system, and do almost anything you want when you want it. I hope you enjoyed our intro. We rigged that shot using the sidecar mount. The sidecar mount is a great way to get the camera on the side of your car quickly and safely. We'll begin this video by setting up the sidecar mount rigging the extruded 80 by 20 aluminum together, and then we're gonna put it on the car. The sidecar mount includes a cheese plate, which has a Mitchell mount. This Mitchell mount is very solid, and in this video, we've converted to a 100 mil bowl to make leveling the head very quick and easy. This is my first rig that utilizes 80 by 20. 80 by 20 is so useful because on each side, it has a slot, which allows you to lock things down and tighten them where you need. This adjustment allows you to shift your camera higher, lower, front, back, and really customize your setup for each scenario. When building the sidecar mount, I start with the two longest bars that have the mounts for the feet. This helps easily identify them. After you've located both of these bars, you take the smallest bar and you slide it down the inlets opposite to the feet mount on each bar. This locks the two largest bars together. Now you've just built the backbone to your sidecar mount. Next you take two of the medium sized bars and you lock them together using two of the smaller size bars. This builds the platform for your tray. Next you take your angled bars and slide them down the bottom of your tray. This is going to help make your system more rigid and prevent play. Following that, I slide these threaded brake pieces down the top slots on the tray. This gives you a mounting position to rig your cheese plate. Now that those bars are locked together, slide in the two remaining threaded brake pieces. This will go on the top medium bars of the tray to give you your final mounting points for the cheese plate. With all of this in place, you can thread down your cheese plate using the included hex tool. The final step of building this system is using two threaded brakes on each side of the backbone so that you can mount your hooks. I like the way these hooks mount because you can adjust their height and dial everything in. The sidecar mount has pads where it mounts your window. When mounting the sidecar mount, I always start with a furniture blanket. The furniture blanket is the extra layer of safety for your car. Once it's there, it's solid. Since we've already built the hostess tray, it's ready to go. All we have to do is set it down. Make sure the tray is solid, not going anywhere. Now that the sidecar is on there, now we start planning out our ratchet straps. The Pro-Am sidecar mount comes with two ratchet straps. Now it's time to mount the tripod head. I'm using a bowl leveling head, so I'll need to use a washer to lock it down. Since we have the bowl mount, it's super quick and easy to level this head. The last part of mounting the rig is just an extra layer of security. I like this layer of safety where I mount the camera to the car with a suction or magnet mount, just so I have one more system that locks the camera in. Now I've got this extra locking point, I feel good. I'm ready to send it. The sidecar mount is great because I can lower the camera mount or raise it depending on what I need. A 
sidecar mount is a great system. Thank you for watching.